if you're logging any of the information from your hot laps at the track, one of the first things you're gonna notice is how hot the oil temperatures get. Oil temperatures on the FRS BRZ86 skyrocket when you're on the track. And one of the best ways to prevent that oil from getting too hot and not giving the protection that you need is to add supplementary oil cooler. Now, the Mishimoto system that we used on all the vehicles in the 86 Challenge, the nice thing about it is application specific. So we had all the fittings, all the adapters, everything we needed to just go ahead and put this cooler right on the vehicle. Now we have a heat exchanger dedicated to getting the heat out of the oil. Now typically, if we didn't have this in the system, we're relying upon the oil just going through the engine and transferring all that heat that it's built up you know, through the cooling system, through the metal in the engine, and, and kind of dispersing it that way. But by having a dedicated uh, oil cooler on the vehicle, we can get a lot more heat out of the oil. All the vehicles in the competition were running on an Enyos 0W50 street racing oil. And it was a great oil, a great match. Um, the factory oil is a 0W20, but when it gets hot, it does not give you the protection that you need and even adding the oil cooler uh, by itself may not be enough. So definitely stepping up to a 0W50 from Enyos is gonna give you a lot more protection on the track. Now you may also notice we added our new radiator. Now the Mishimoto radiators, their lifetime warranty, and again, I'll just bolt on direct fit. Um, so you put it in the car and just kind of forget it from that point. Mishimoto designed and engineered the radiator to improve the heat exchange from the coolant to the air. And that's done by basically varying the fin count in here, how thick the core is inside, how big the end tanks are, where the flow is directed. All that's kind of engineered into this heat exchange unit here called a radiator to get your cooling system uh, to run some cooler temperatures, exchange more heat out of it. Now, why is that important? Well, at stock horsepower levels on the street, probably not, a, not an issue at all. But as you add horsepower, you also add wasted heat. Now, the energy we get from the gasoline in a car, 65% of it doesn't get used to make horsepower. That 65% is going out in exhaust heat or going into the cooling system as waste heat. So if you think about it, if you've doubled the horsepower, now you've doubled the amount of energy you put into that cooling system. And it's extremely important to get that out. We need to keep the cooling temperatures uh, of both the engine coolant and the engine oil in the right operating range.